Um, and my hair is wet because I just took a shower, so mm, I'm clean. Everyone, welcome back to my channel. Just a really quick intro. This is Feeding Reptiles. Um, I threw a tarantula in there for the people here, only for tarantulas. I have a couple shout outs at the end, so definitely stay tuned and check them out. I think you'll like them if you don't already know them. Like the video if you like the video, so. Okay, bye. <laughs> Let's get right into this. So this is Rango, our crested gecko, and here he is enjoying a little bit of rapashi. He doesn't normally eat live insects regularly, but occasionally we do feed him a few crickets. That said, this is probably his favorite, so that is what we gave him this feeding. To tut the bearded dragon, here I have some turnip greens, blueberries, and green peppers prepared for him. And then I also go ahead and give him some bugs covered in calcium. We have super worms and dubio roaches this time. So this is his first meal of the day and ignore the little poopies. He definitely does that a lot. But if you consider how much he eats and compare it to what comes out, I think it's pretty expected because this guy has an appetite. He eats more than anything I've ever seen, as you can tell. He's a very hungry, growing bearded dragon. He usually goes for the bugs first, so in this case he went for a roach first and then now he's moved on to the super worms. I think he prefers the dubias best, um, but he does also enjoy eating his veggies, which is kind of a new thing to him. He, if, if you can see, he goes right for a blueberry here, which I do supplement uh, with some blueberries here and there, but I do know that shouldn't be a regular thing. Also, I give him some crickets, and this is from a different feeding, but I just thought it was too cute not to include. He's just sitting there, and he's waiting for his crickets, but um, he probably should check his head because it's, it's on your head, dude. Like, look up. See? It's like on your head. Like, how are you missing this right now? Wait, where'd it go? Oh, I think he got it. What do you think? Did he get it? <laughs> Her little tongue was hitting my tongue. Ew. Or not my tongue, but my nose. <laughs> okay, so my husband is the one who feeds the snakes. And this is my snake Ichabod. He is a little bit more aggressive than Chili. As you can even tell, like look at him take this thing down. He is so ready to eat all the time.
course, this is a tarantula channel, so I definitely had to include at least one tarantula eating. This is Salem, the infamous Gramostola pulchra, and he just took it right away. It's a giant mealworm. This is my first time feeding these, and so far so good. I think everybody is pretty happy with them, and yeah, not really much to say about him because he just grab the food and then this is scarlet my youthless species red and she almost never eats like maybe she's eaten one or two crickets since i've gotten her in like january which was like what two three months ago i'm not i don't know time space whatever but anyway yeah she just does not eat very often why she's never really included in my feeding videos though because she doesn't take them I ended up just leaving a cricket in there with her and eventually they disappear so that is what I do that is our technique for her um, but yeah and at least I hope you enjoy these shots of her because I don't show her as much as I'd like to first shout out goes to Andrew's tarantulas I really love his feeding clips so if you like feeding videos check him out Next shout out goes to Molten Bolt Exotics. I just love his taste in animals. He really has quality over quantity and his reptiles are cool. And then Bug Realms, of course. He's got the best bugs. I love his bugs. So if you're into other insects, check them out. That is all I have for you guys today. So definitely like the video if you liked it, subscribe if you like my content, and stay tuned because we have a reptile expo coming up next video and I don't want you to miss what I'm picking up. See you then.